Aquarifal here. So today I wanted to do more of a personal video um, that's not something school related or like a day in the life or anything like that. Um, this is a personal like conviction video I guess. Um, okay so one thing that is different about um, the girls in particular uh, in our family, me and my husband, um, is that we wear skirts. So me and my two daughters we wear um, either skirts or dresses full time that are past the knee. Um, I want to emphasize right now that obviously I believe in this um, idea, but I do not think it is for everyone. I do not think like the whole planet to just wear skirts. Like I don't think that way. Um, I feel strongly about it, and so I do it. That's it's my own personal thing, and a lot of um, things that we do or whatever that we understand that like homeschooling and skirt wearing and stuff like that is personal convictions that we personally have. So I just wanted to get that out of the way before someone is like typing away very angrily like, oh, you know, I've gotten comments that I think I'm better than other people or something, which I do not. Um, okay. So one of the reasons that I wear skirts is for femininity. Now, um, I watch... April Cassidy, she is a vlogist, and she actually wrote a book um, about um, biblical submission to her husband, and she um, began wearing skirts. Uh, I started wearing skirts before I heard this, but um, it was very uh, like encouraging, and I really loved the way that she said it, and I even asked my husband, and he said, yes, that makes a lot of sense. So... Um, with femininity, the greater the distance between masculine and feminine, the greater the attraction. So, I grew up by raised by a single father, and um, I can talk about my testimony at a later date. But um, so, with being raised with a single father, a lot of the things were like cars and like really manly stuff. And so, all throughout high school, I wore like band T-shirts and jeans and. Um, Chuck Taylors. Uh, I don't know if I may know who those are, but um, and so I was not the most feminine person. Um, up until recently, I had no idea like what foundation was. Um, it's really kind of embarrassing because I am a girl, but um, yeah, I just recently started doing like my makeup every day. Um, and so I always, you know, strive to look feminine, but um. I don't know. I just, it never, it never really happened. And so skirts give me a way to be super comfortable because let's face it, it's like an elastic band. It's pretty much yoga pants without the middle divider every day. And, um, it gave me a way to look dressy every single day without really putting in like a ton of effort to look dressier. Um, I, um, so, and then another thing is that, um, I was raised in an abusive home. My father is very verbally and emotionally abusive. And so from that, I ended up um, holding a lot of anger in my heart. And sometimes I would be a little more short with my children than I would like to be. And so um, skirts remind me that I am a woman and I am feminine. And I am supposed to be the gentler side of, you know, me and my husband, not seeing my husband is super harsh or um, hard or anything, nothing like that, but it helps me, it helps me on a daily basis to remember I want to have grace with my children. I want to show them God's love through my actions. I want to end the cycle of you know, yelling and screaming to get their attention and to make them do what I want them to do. I want that to end with me. Um, and so, Obviously, I still have days where I'm just a little bit more aggravated or, you know, short with them, but I feel that this has really given me um, more of a every single day reminder that I need to be graceful with my children. I follow the Duggars, and I know there's a lot of controversy about the Duggars, and that's not what this video is about, so I'm not even going to get into that, but... Um, 
I do follow them. And I read their book and I really felt it placed on my heart at that point. Um, when they were talking about all the reasons that they wear skirts and, um, you know, how Michelle Jugger used to like mow her lawn in a bikini. And now she's super conservative with the way that she dresses and talks. Um, and so, um, I felt it put in my heart at that point, but I kind of brushed it off and didn't really think much about it. Well, then a close friend to my, of mine, um, her whole family wears skirts and all the girls. And then, um, slowly but surely, it just kept coming up. Um, and so I prayed on it. I really, I went to God with it. And, um, yeah, I definitely felt that this was something I was being called to do. And praise God that I made the choice to switch because I am more gentle with my husband. I'm more gentle with my children. I'm just more gentle um, and more feminine all around. It's just, it's been a great um, kind of tool for me, more or less. Um, another thing is that I try to be modest in all of my clothing, not just my skirts, but also my shirts or blouses. Um, I try to make sure that they're covering my cleavage. Um, when I go swimming, I, I do wear a tankini with a cover. Um, I strive to not cause a brother in Christ to stumble based on my appearance. Now, I, again, I want to emphasize that these are my personal convictions, and I'm not saying that wearing jeans causes every single guy to stumble. Men are responsible for their thoughts. I just want to make it, I guess, easier on them to not stumble because of me wearing skin tight shorts or, you know, super, super short shorts or um, jeans that are skin tight or something like that. Again, my own personal conviction. Um, I also, you know, don't, not, I don't only strive to be modest within my clothing. It is also my actions, my speak. I really turn away from, like, cussing a lot. Um, or me and my husband have almost completely done away with alcohol. I, he will have an occasional beer or whatever here or there. But, yeah. We don't really, you know, drink heavily or anything. I don't, I'm not really rowdy person or anything. And so I try to be very modest within um, the way I present myself. I try to be very gentle with people and very loving. And um, I'm, yeah, I just, that's just something that I do. So, again, my personal conviction on, um, you know, modesty and skirt wearing and the reasons we do it. And um, so I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, click subscribe below. We are trying to do a video every single week um, to just see more of what we do and how we do it and all the great things that come with being a mother of three children and um, everything else. So see you later.